Hello and welcome to another episode by CDBTC. Today is Monday, October 16th, and uh, this video is going to be about how to open an Ethereum wallet on my Ether wallet or MEW mail. Uh, I don't know how that's pronounced, but MEW, my Ether wallet. And why is an Ethereum wallet important? An Ethereum wallet is important because this is what you will require to have in order to receive the tokens from ethereum based ico's so if you have an ico that's based on the ethereum blockchain they will ask you to have a wallet that is able to receive erc20 tokens and and uh you cannot use the wallets on the exchanges uh they actually recommend not to use the wallets on the exchanges for receiving tokens because they might get lost they might never make it so it's super important to have your own wallet and it's very easy to uh, create one and use it at first it looks a little bit daunting but once you get used to it you'll see that it's very very easy and i think that it's um very convenient because you store not only your ethereum this is my wallet you store not only your ethereum but you also store the tokens that you get from participating in uh, ICOs. So for example, this is my Ethereum wallet. I have my ETH in here, and I also have access to my tokens from previous ICOs. So this is my Air tokens, this is my Cobin Hood tokens, and these are my Crypto20 tokens. So it's very, very convenient. But as I said, it's required uh, to participate in uh, ERC20 based ICOs. So, what is the first step? Uh, you have to create a new wallet. Uh, and to create a new wallet, you just have to input your a password. So, I'm gonna give this thing a password. I'm gonna hit the create new wallet button. And this is super important. Save this file. Save this file. Do not lose it, as it says here, it cannot be recovered if you lose it. Do not share it, or you will put your money and tokens in jeopardy and make a backup. Don't lose the backup. Make sure you place the backup in a safe place. So you hit the download key store file. It's downloaded. And I hit I understand. This is your private key. Also, print it out. Put, I'll copy it in a safe place take care of it okay so uh, once you do that you have created your wallet so how do you access your wallet you access your wallet by hitting uh, this button view wallet information and it asks you how would you like to access your wallet in our case uh, we are gonna use this because this is what we got the key store file we select the wallet file and we're gonna go to the downloads and hit on that then we're gonna input our password the one we defined and we hit the unlock button and that's it that's it the wallet is open this is your wallet address you can also download the file again which you already have if you open the wallet, so it doesn't make sense. This is the private key. If you want to see it, you hit the little I. I'm not going to do that. And this is your address, uh, it, which you can scan. Uh, when you have tokens, you're going to be able to see them here. Uh, most of the tokens load automatically. You just hit the load token balances, but some do not. So you have to add the custom tokens, and they're going to show in here. Uh, this is what happened with the crypto 20 I had to add it manually um, and that's basically it so when you go into an ICO they're gonna ask for your ETH wallet address you're gonna have to give them this number and this is where they will send you the tokens and when they send you the tokens they're gonna be they're gonna appear down here uh, you just gonna have to hit load token balances and they're gonna load up uh, if they're hidden show tokens and they will be shown 
and if they don't sh appear here but you know that you bought them you're gonna have to add the custom token and I'm gonna have a video uh, in a while uh, on how to do it because I will be purchasing some gold rewards tokens and uh, I'm gonna talk about that in a, in a minute uh, Bitcoin net result for the day, wow, $477 in the lending wallet, $477 with 62 cents. Uh, these are the interest for tonight. And um, I'm, I have good use for these, uh, for this money today. I'm going to put it towards, um, ooh, waves, <laughs> waves. Okay, so I'm putting that in Bittrex. Okay, so as you can see, super easy uh, to close the wallet. You just close the page. That's it. Uh, I'm going to show you, for example, uh, if you want to check on on transfer status, you hit here. Look, transferring ETH is super fast. Unlike Bitcoin, Bitcoin may take 10 minutes, 15 minutes, 30 minutes. I had a day of 13 hours just four days ago. Uh, ETH is almost instant so I love that I love that it just seems since it, this is a little bit new to me it seems a little bit daunting and that's why I decided to make this video and I'm gonna make another one uh, following on where I will show how it's actually done but this video was about how to create the wallet how to open the wallet okay so I hope you enjoyed it uh, have a good night